Right. <clears throat> Obviously, I've taken a knee with that helicopter was I've just seen. That was the WPDE helicopter unit, that was. That's one of the um, Southwestern Dish Fishing helicopters. As this is the one of the electricity ones as we sometimes see apparently. If I go to ADXB, there he is, look. So as you can see, that was Eurocopter EC135 minus P1. And as you can see, the rate is GWPDA, that is. And as you can see, the course on is EL E67. Whereas you can see here, like it's just to cover as base to call map up new key. Well, obviously, that's not the basis from though. <clears throat> obviously, that was the time it took off as he was on the ground at 9.03 a.m. as he was at. Obviously, yeah, so what he was about 10,000 feet. That was the time it took off, was around 9.03 a.m. And the height he flew there was about 12,000 feet, as we just saw it from the distance, but literally just flew past David Mape. He did. Obviously, where you, where you can see today, it's just going around to do some polar wire checking today, which, um, as you can see now, it's just probably going to do some polar wire checking just over, yeah, as you can see, just over by um, Bob Peking, whatever it is. So, yeah, so that's one of the electricity helicopters. That's, this is the one that's based at Bristol Airport one. So, yeah, this is the one that's based at Bristol Airport. <coughs> So yeah, this is one of the electricity helicopters that we sometimes see apparently, but it looks like it's heading towards Morning Smith now by the looks of it. But hopefully we might get to see it fly back, but I don't know yet, but it's just now going to do some pilot wires checking. Probably just near Morning Smith, but anyway. Obviously this is the one that's based at uh, Bristol Airport in Somerset. Obviously that's not the one that's took off at uh, Bristol today, but that's just took, obviously because today that just took off at Newquay Airport. So this is where it just took off from today, just took off at Newquay Airport. Okay, so yep, yeah, thanks for watching, bye bye.
Right. Okay, so that was the uh, Euro Composite Easy 1.5 minus P1. Um, operated by Southwestern Dish Fusion Electricity Helicopter, that was. I have to say, though, that, was some, that is definitely some low pass there, actually, I have to admit, from the uh, electricity helicopter. That was some performance, that was. That was some performance display from that helicopter, I have to say, that, I have to admit. Only just because this is only doing, um, um, looking up, just looking for polars, wire checking, that's what he's up to today, apparently. So, as you can see, the course on his ELC67, that was. God, I have to say, that was some low pass that was from the electricity, I have to admit. As you can see, he's did one over B. Water, and then probably just did one, probably, as you can see, the star wave, he was nearer to Morning Smith, but as you can see, some performance pass I will have to admit from the electricity, that was some performance that was. And then, as you can see from here, as you can see, he was literally just between 300 feet and... 100 feet, honestly, that was such a low pass that was, honestly, that was such an amazing pass from that helicopter I've just seen, that was such an amazing pass that was. God, that was such a low pass from that electricity helicopter by you, come to easy one five. literally, that was such a low pass, honestly. That's just absolutely amazing pass that was, honestly, that flight pass was just amazing, literally. I tell you what though, I've never seen the helicopter like come here like low before anyway, but literally just like the other side of Penryn though, literally. Literally, just um, where we first saw it, he was literally, um, he was literally just um, nearer to the industrial state, I think. Yeah, and he literally flew past near Found School. Um, yeah, just flew past over there, apparently. And he just come in, just flew past Penryn by the looks of it. Honestly, that was such a low pass I've ever seen from that helicopter, actually. God. God, I bet if one of you guys are going to love it, you're going to be able to think about com coming to me that on YouTube, like, literally, you guys are going to so love it. That is such a low pass from that helicopter, anyway. Honestly, that is such a low pass I've seen from the helicopter. But anyway. God, honestly, that was such a low pass from that one, anyway. I don't know where he's in now. He's now on, it's not on Flyway 24, anyway, but I suppose it's on Plane Fighter. Yep, Plane Fighter's got that, apparently. God, you see how much low pass it did there, literally, about 100 feet, honestly, that was such a low pass. But it looks as if now it's going to go back to to where it started, probably back to Newquay Airport, I think. It's probably going to go back to back to Cormac Airport, Newquay, I think, for a break. And then he might be coming back here, I suppose, probably till this afternoon, though. And then he, hopefully for the time he might be reviewing, he might be going for the stop review at um, field stop at Newquay Airport. And then he might be on his way back to his base at Bristol Airport. Because I think Richard, this is where he's come from, apparently. He's from Bristol Airport. So, yeah, because this helicopter here has come from Bristol Airport. As you can see, that was WPD helicopter unit. That was, I have to admit, though. But, obviously, that's one of the several helicopters we've ever seen. But it's not a military one. But this is the civil electricity helicopter, as we basically see. But this is the one that does training for uh, pilot wires and all that. So, this is the one that's been out doing training by the looks of it. But hopefully we might be able to see it coming back later on, but I don't know yet, but we'll have to wait and see. But anyway, might have to wait and see when if it comes back here later on though, but I don't know yet anyway. Might be till this afternoon though, but we'll just have to wait and see. But anyway, see yep, and that was the electricity helicopter we've just seen. That was operated by a southwestern helicopter unit, that was. One of the power distribution, that was. See yep, as you can see now it's heading back to, to where it started from, back to Cormac Airport, Newquay. So it might be, or whatever, it might, it might not come back here this afternoon, but anyway, however's if though, but anyway, I'll have to wait and see what this helicopter's going to do anyway, but it might come back, I don't know yet, but honestly, it might be going straight back to Bristol Airport anyway, but I don't know yet. Okay, so yep, thanks for watching, bye-bye.
Okay, so I'm taking that was the same helicopter we saw as we just saw this morning though. So as you can see, that was the Eurocopter EC135 minus P1, that was. So as you can see, that was the one of the Southwestern power distribution helicopter that was, operated by electricity. As you can see, it's just now come back to do another Polar check-in again, but at the same place. But this time it's literally just, um, it's just literally around ne near my place this time apparently. Maybe as you can see here, look, it's probably just nearer to, um, where is, where is he now though? Um, it's probably, look as if he's probably nearer to somewhere, as I say, but I have no clue where he is, but probably near the A39, I suppose, probably just near the A39 road by the looks of it, as it's just now dropping back down the feet again by the looks of it, it's now back to do some polar checking. And the height he flew, Star with is about, we was about 10,000 feet and then he just dropped at 900 feet which then it just dropped back down at 300 feet so unfortunately it's just come back and do another part of our checking again though but as if so yeah and again it took off at the same spot at Corn Airport Newquay took off the same spot at Corn Airport Newquay as it was around as it took off at 12 23 pm so yeah so this is where we just had a break that time anyway so yeah might get some more features of it, hopefully, but I'm um, hopefully I was thinking might get some more features of this helicopter if it like comes back around and do a like does a low pass. But I'm hoping it might come back and do a low pass anyway. But might catch some more features of it, but I don't know yet. But anyway, okay. So yeah, might catch some more features of it, hopefully. See so, yep, ya. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Okay. Okay, so that was the hold on. Where was the electricity one now? Oh, maybe maybe he's out of <coughs> sorry, at twenty four. That looks a bit out of radar. Sorry, at the moment. I've just actually seen it on there, but it's just it's not popped up on ADXB anyway. But obviously, because that was the electricity helicopter, I've just now seen it probably. But once again, but once again, it's just now at the other side anyway. So anyway, just you could tell, guys, I've just got a feeling because my camcorder wasn't my camcorder was seen to be out of focus because um you may <clears throat> you may go to have a feeling, guys, because my camcorder just seems to be out of focus because I've just dropped my camcorder by mistake probably. So. This is why, because the lens seems to have gone wrong on it. So, anyway, obviously when I when I see the next aircraft, right, it would probably just go and focus again. It would anyway. So, so anyway, so as you can see now, it's probably just probably looks as if now it's just done his polar wire check in over as he was as he was just here, as he was just nearer to yeah, just nearer Koenig Road. <coughs> This is where we first saw it, it was literally just from that distance, anyway, this is where we first saw it. And it literally he's just turned right as he was going back towards the other way, but it looks as if now he's going to go back to his base, to, travelling back to his base to Bristol Airport by the looks of it. So yeah, so I think this is where he's going to go back to, apparently, back to his base to um, Bristol Airport, I think. So yeah, I think this is where he's now travelling back to now is Bristol Airport. 
but at least the call sign at least at least I had the same call sign which it was E L E six seven. So yeah, that was that same call sign as we just seen about this. That's just that same call sign, which it was E L E six seven. It was. Okay, so yeah. Obviously, when I see an next aircraft coming in, I've got, got to go careful with the camera cooler because I've literally just dropped it by accident. So, but don't worry, this is it's just Lisa's, it's Lisa's just now survived anyway. But it just went out of focus the next minute, just next minute, it just went out of focus as I just felt it, anyway, <clears throat> as I just felt it anyway. But anyway, as you can see now, as you can see, it's not on Flyway 24 and ADXB at the moment because I just saw it went off somewhere. So, anyway. But hopefully it should be back on Flyway 24 soon, apparently. So, <clears throat> yeah. At least we got some good shot from it, actually. I will have to admit, at least we got some good shot from the electricity today, apparently. Got some good shot from it, apparently, today. At least today we got some good shot from it. Good shot from the low pass, apparently. Especially the low pass, I like <clears throat> I like seeing, though. Especially seeing doing some hovering as well. Especially if I saw it hovering around between... Well, actually, it was actually between just between Buda Water and then it came sort of around here anyway. When she was at Mung Gunling for wherever it is. <clears throat> so, yeah, he was actually around between Hillhead Road. So, yeah, this is where this area was. Literally just above the A39. That's where he was, he was around that area, he was anyway. That's when he was around that area. So, yeah, that you see. So, yes, he was running this area, it was as he was doing hovering for checking out for wires. Okay, so as you can see, it's not on Flyway 24 for the moment, so, and like I said, I've got to go careful with my camera cord anyway, because, as you can see, it's not fully damaged, but it's just, it's the, I've just dropped it by accident. Okay, so, yep, so, yeah, so that was electricity I've just seen now, so, yep, as you can see, it's now gone back to, I think it's probably going back to New Airport first, and then heading back to its base, the Bristol Airport, I think, by the time, obviously, because this is where, because this is where Bristol is, though, as you can see, there's Bristol, if I could find the airport. There's Bristol Airport there, though. You can see it. There's Bristol Airport. That's where the electricity helicopter is based at. This is where it's based at Bristol Airport. So, yeah, this is where it's based at, apparently, at, uh, <coughs> at um, Bristol Airport. So, yeah, this is where the, this is where all of the electricity helicopters are based at, uh, Bristol Airport. Okay, but it looks as if now it's going to go back to Newquay. By the looks of it. But hopefully, it'll be back on, it'll be back on the track soon, hopefully. Back on the plane fighter track soon, apparently. So, yep. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.